everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Sword. I have made an executive decision because I'm sick and tired of playing this stupid game. That what I'm going to do with the last this is the last week of Pokemon Sword. So what we're going to do with this today's episode and the next two, we're going to show off the DLC, downloadable content, and I'm done with the game. I can't be bothered doing the post game stuff with Sword Bird and Shield Bird. We're going to talk to this guy. That's an armor pass. With that pass, you can go to the Isle of Armoire. You have a crime pass, too. You can also go to the Crime Tundra. So we are going to go to the armor station. And I'm going to show off a little bit of um, the Isle of Armoire. That's what we're going to do. And then, this is supposed to be Northern Ireland, I think. Which isn't quite accurate, but whatever. And... Then in the next two episodes, we're going to show off a little bit of the Crown Tundra. And then I'm done. I just can't be bothered playing this stupid game anymore. That's... A f <laughs> I don't care if that's controversial. But um, I think we've got everything we need out of this game. Is this your first visit to the Isle of Armoire? I'm researching Pokemon Biology here on this island. You want to register the Pokemon you catch on this island to your Pokedex? Love updating your Pokedex. You can just do that. Thank you. Pokedex has been updated. The Isle of ba 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 it's always, there's always just a lot of yap yap. There's so much yap yap. Who's this guy? Hello. I'm supposed to join the dojo on this island today, but there's a strange person standing outside the station. I'm a bit scared to head out. Ah. Uh, that's not, that's how normal, natural, real people move. Mm hmm. There you are. Right on time. You're perfectly punctual for a kid. Have you met before? It doesn't really matter. Hello, Clara. All right, so this girl, I think she uses poison Pokemon. And I don't have anything good against poison, so I'll just hit her really hard with stuff. Uh, I don't care. Yeah, let's have a battle. All right. So all I'm going to do is show off a lot of the downloadable content stuff. I'm not going to show the whole story. If you are, are interested in Pokemon Sword... And haven't get yet got the DLC. This will not be a spoiler for you. Okay. Why on earth you've got this far and you haven't decided to play this stupid game to the DLC? Maybe you just don't want to buy the DLC. That's fair enough. I understand that, you know. So, she's using that Pokeball wrong. Then he peed. So that's fair enough. If you haven't bought the DLC or whatever, that's fine. Um, I'm, uh, but this will just be a little bit of a, of a tease for it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna show you the whole thing. I mean, like I said, mainly because I can't be bothered. You know, a Vanipede I can take down with Smish. I'm not at all afraid of that little bug. You know what I mean? I can take on a bug. I squish a bug, hit a bug, punch a bug. I'll punch a bug. You don't think I'll punch a bug? Look at that. Nothing. The first damage you took on the Isle of Armoire. What a, what, what a gift. Uh, what a gift. You know. Hurricane. I can't even knock out a little tiny bug bug. Ridiculous. So on the Isle of Armoire, you can do all sorts of stuff. You can evolve a Galarian Slowpoke. Because the world was like, we need more Galarian Kanto Pokemon. And they were like, here's a Slowpoke. Hi, ah, you happy now? And people were like, not really. So, here it is. This should not be a thing. This, I mean, I feel like I'm just running through the motions here. But this is the end of Pokemon Sword. So you may as well enjoy it. This is what it is. You know, it's uh, it's not going to get any better than this. This is a fact. That was super effective. What the hell? Hi... Clow Razy. Oh, I don't like her. Oh, I don't like her. Oh, no, I don't. She's saying things. She's doing stuff. I, I don't like it. I, I, at an incredible rate. No, sir. I need to get Crunch. Give me Crunch. I want to Crunch on this little slowpoke. I want to eat his tail the way Shelder does. I want to eat his tail the way Team Rocket does in Generation 2. I want to eat his tail. And then that's the end of that sentence i'm gonna eat his tail i'm going to eat him i'm gonna f consume it i'm gonna put it in my mouth nom nom yeah that was it 
my next Pokemon's gonna make. That was my last one. You don't even know what Pokemon you have? Come on now, dude. Ah, no way. There must be some sort of mistake. Um, how did this kid get so strong? Because I'm really, I'm the fucking champion. See, that's another thing. The idea of this is that I, the wrong person is turned up. They're going to get me to join the dojo whenever it was that man inside the train station that really wanted to join the dojo. Okay? Which kind of is a good angle, but I'm like, dude, I just, I'm the champion. I just won the championship. What well, you know, I'm kind of a big deal, right? Oh, we got a new fashion car just in time. How, how about that? We get to try out new fashion hairstyles. So excitement, much excitement. So this game introduced some more Pokemon, including over there, a big ass fucking Waylord. Oh, Kingler, all oh, crunchy Kingler. Oh, I'm gonna catch him. Look at him with his big old claw. Hello. Oh, what are you gonna crunch me with your big claw? Are you gonna he's gonna crunch me to death? Yes, you are, Mr. Big Crab. Oh, he's gonna hit me with his big claw. Cram. Oh, he's gonna crush me in my sleep. Yes, little baby. We're gonna catch a Kingler. Today's episode. Nothing happens, but then also I catch a Kingler. It's just the way it is. Let's see, of course we're gonna use a nest ball. We want little Kingler to have a lovely little nest, a little crab's nest. Do crabs make nests? Where do crabs live? In the sea? Do they make nests? I don't know. I'm not a crabologist, I'll be honest with you. I don't really know the ins and outs of crabology. You know? You have to go to school for 50 years to learn everything about crabs, and I just don't have the time. Allure ball. It's a, for water Pokemon, so this should be good, right? We gotta catch old, old Kingler right here. Yes. Oh, we got him. Kali. Perfect. So, I don't remember in this game if they let me explore the whole island at once. Or if I have to go to the dojo and do some stuff. I don't remember how that works. Um, we're going to call him King Crab. Uh, because he is a crab. And he is the king of crabs. They keep bringing a new crab Pokemon. I'm like, you, you kind of nailed over this one. With Kingler right, right off the bat. I don't know why you need to go and get more crab-like Pokemon. Seems ridiculous, but whatever. Are you going to fight me? I saw the most awesome Pokemon ever. I can show you its Pokedex entry. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's see. Horsey. I actually do really like Horsey. They're really cool. I really like um, Kingdra. I think Kingdra is uh, a real interesting Pokemon. You know, I have I used a Kingdra before. I feel like I have in Pokemon Gold and Silver. I might have used a Kingdra. So, like I said, I don't remember if they need me to go to the dojo to open up most of the island. So, what I'm going to do is just bypass that by using the water. Um, I don't want this. I don't want this. Now, one thing that annoyed me about this DLC is that it's very sparse. Like, what I wanted from Pokemon DLC. Oh, here comes. Hang on. I see a Sharpedo, so we want to be alive for that, because we're going to punch it in the fucking head. Oh, we're absolutely going to punch that Sharpedo in the head. But I wanted, and maybe this was just, apparently this was just me. But I'm like, why aren't there more Pokemon trainers here? Do you know what I mean? Like, why, why is it just the dojo kids that come here? I want to fight people. I want to fight Pokemon trainers. That's kind of what this game is about, right? And so you see stuff. And you're like, wow, look at this. But it's a blobby little ditto. Oh, we needed a ditto for um, breeding purposes. In the game, that is. Not in real life. I don't need a ditto to breed with in real life. That's disgusting. How dare you? Will this kill it? Oh, he went first. 
How bad is my speed where the ditto goes first? I don't know. Superpower. Hey, that did all right, man. That was all right. That did some damage. Let's just do a little brick break, and then we should be good. Oh, but that's going to put his defense down, too. Is it? What? How? <laughs> what? How did the ditto beat me? I me. That's silly. I don't. I don't agree with that. Can I bite him? Can I? Can I just like chomp on him? Can I give him a little bit of a gum gum? You know what I mean? Let me see. Can I bite him? Oh yeah, I could totally bite him. That's perfect. Revange. Uh, is that enough to kill me? No, great. We're going to use a great ball to commemorate the fact that it was great. We're going to use a great ball. It's a pretty good ball, frankly. You know? Uh, we got a ditto. That's great. Very happy, very pleased. So happy we caught a ditto. It's really going to make my life different. Plum Eyes can learn Crunch. What the hell? Why can't Smish? Smish, you got, we gotta get you a uh, crunch somehow. A little boy, a little baby boy. A little crunch of palooza. Ditto. I don't even know where the hell you're, you're supposed to get a ditto. I have a ditto somewhere. I don't know where I got him from. But anyway, my point still stands. Is that, it, like, there's stuff here. It just doesn't feel like it's a very interesting, populated place. Right, uh, which I think is stupid, because you want that from a Pokemon game. They won't let me go that. F what? You won't let me go that way? Let me look at the map. Where am I? Why can't I go this way? Oh, they're gonna close it off to me. I. St they, they're gonna make me fucking do the. All right. Well, whatever. We're not missing a whole lot. They're gonna make me do the fucking story I guess to open up the whole island I see you're too clever for me game you've outplayed me well then for like 10 minutes or whatever let's just do some story there's a oh there's a little bit little diggle little diggle die 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 glat oh diglet you're here oh good thing this guy's right here with his fucking sunglasses or whatever hello thank you for finding my diglet <laughs> By the way, I have a shit ton of other diglets that I also lost. You could say I'm really bad. You might even say these diglets want to stay away from me completely. They don't like me. I'm a terrible trainer. They've run away from me. And I think that you should bring them all back to me. Bye. You know, like, there's one. So this is the stuff you get to look forward to. If you pay like 15 extra points or dollars if that's your currency or yen or I don't know else what else. There are no other currencies. If you spend all that stuff. Oh, she's going to customize my bike. Yes. Do that. Um, you can collect diglets. That's all you can do. And you can get a new Pokemon that is a little little bear. Uh, sparkling white, glistening black. Let me see. Let me see. Let's have a look. Not bad, man. My oh, my speed is to the max. My bag looks weird, though. I don't know if I like it. Okay, they are gonna let me just look toot around wherever I want. So I'm just gonna show it off, right? I'm not gonna do the dojo stuff. If you haven't bought the DLC, that's all you. You can look at the 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 dojo whenever you want. But, just, you know, let's have a look at the locale. There is a forest right here. There are two different dojos you are supposed to go to. Or two different towers, I should say. So there's a dojo back there. And then you can come along here and explore some stuff. Wonderful. There's a little cave in there we'll go to later. Cromerant. Uh, there is one of the dojos, which is the one I think I use. I went to this one. One of them is like a water one, and then one of them is a dark one, I think. I don't know. It's not that important. Okay. So there we go. There is uh, that guy. 
Um, should we go to the forest real quick? I think we might do just to show it off a little bit and see what's inside. You know, we're not gonna spend. We're just gonna spend one episode on this, so let's let's just go through it pretty quickly. Like I said, you know, the the DLC is for you to explore, and in this game, whenever you go to the to the dojo, they do have a way that you can kind of explore the island. Instead of doing it yourself like this, uh, uh, oh yeah, let's see whatever this is. We're gonna save. Um, all right, let's dig. What do you got for me, kid? Probably nothing, but that's gambling for you. Um, yeah, do one more, and then we'll quit. I can quit anytime I want. Oh well, tits. <laughs> that's g <laughs> that's gambling for you. <laughs> Who cares? So here's a little forest, right? And then if we go through the forest, eventually we should be able to get to a like a desert area. I think that that's on the other end of the the forest. And you then after this, you can make up your own mind, you know. So, like I said, that if you go to the dojo, they find a way to let you explore pretty well. Oh, I'm not falling for this again. See, there's people around. Why don't they want to fight me, yes. you know? Could they just not be bothered? Could they not, like, figure out a way to make it seem natural to have loads of Pokemon fights? I don't know. I'm annoyed about that. So, there's the other dojo right there. If we go up, this kind of to the left will lead to, like, a wee desert area I think maybe that's up this way uh, maybe it's where we came from maybe it's down there I don't know um, there's a big scary dojo up here so this is I think this is the dark one will they let me in without earth Shifu? I don't know hello scary girl this is a tower of darkness you were not yet ready to climb the tower leave this place all right well you know, I was just trying to be useful and friendly and nice. And then you were just kind of rude. Is there a Diglett? I thought I saw a Diglett. We're not going to catch them all. I don't care enough about Diglett to catch them all. Where is the little desert area? It's around here somewhere. I think it's down here. The cave, by the way, that we saw earlier these over there so we'll come back here go through the cave and then we'll, that'll that'll be us having done a little a little circle of the whole game magic the whole DLC so it's a nice area I'll give them that right I like the look of the area I just don't like anything I think it's too sparse the Pokemon are here but like well, what else is here why aren't there other people who want to come here and fight their Pokemon you know, it's just other people who are like, oh, uh, oops. Oh, it's a Torkoal. Hey, I find this Pokemon. Do you like it? I would always say I like it, but that shit I could discover by myself. I don't see why I need this guy to fill in my Pokedex for me, you know? Like, why don't some of these people fight me? I don't understand. Stealth Rock, that's not Crunch, so it's no use to me. We didn't get a whole lot of really good TMs in this playthrough, I gotta say. Are you gonna dig for me? Oh, there's your shovel. Um, Yeah, we'll do it one more time. Why not? So last time, we dug twice, and then the thing broke. So let's try that again. Um, So I want her to go again. And then we'll quit after this one. Because I know how to gamble properly. All right. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Come on, dude. Twice in the one episode. I don't know, fruit. You have to collect these for the story mission. Just a spoiler alert. So here's a little desert area. Ooh, spooky. You know? I got a bag of stardust, though. That's pretty cool. So there's not a whole lot of stuff here either. It's just Pokemon. If you want Pokemon, come here and you'll find them. And uh, you'll probably have to come here if you want a Diglett. I remember spending the whole day just looking for Diglett here. There is one. 
Because I had like three left to find, and it was annoying the hell out of me. So, yeah, there's two in this tunnel. Two more to find in this tunnel. There is one. It tells you how many are left in like each area, but I honestly couldn't be bothered. There's, I believe I could see the other one. Yeah, there he is. So we've done this one for the tunnel. Pretty cool. You know, I feel like a real, real winner. I look like a real winner too with my badge that says winner on it. Yeah, I might have bought it, but that doesn't mean I'm not a winner. You know, you can buy things that also corroborate who you are. You know, that's a lie. Like if you go to the, if it's your birthday and you go to the shop and you get a cake that says birthday boy on it. Well, that's just you telling people it's your birthday. You know, it's not that weird about that. It's normal. I don't know why you guys are making it weird. I don't appreciate that. You know, you guys are always trying to make it sound like everything I do is weird. Not everything. Just some of the things, you know. Get a Pokeball metal coat. That'll help me evolve a Steelix from a Steelix. All right. So I'm probably not, if I see him, I'm going to pick him up, but probably not going to be uh, picking them all up. Um, I think that AAAE exit is where we uh, saw earlier. Oh, I got too fast on my, on my bicycle. It scared me. I don't, I mean, I don't need to find five more. There is one, but these ones are not hidden at all <laughs> they seem pretty obvious which is is good for me a big dumbass you know there is one look at this i'm finding them quicker here than i did my first run through i don't need to find them and i won't i'm not going to so there's another one good god we're gonna explore a little bit more not too much more we're almost done like I said, this is really just me showing off the Isle of Armoire. You know, hopefully you guys like it. You know, I, like I said, I find this one to be the the not as good, not as interesting as the other one. The other one had potential. I don't think that this one really lived up to a lot of that potential. But there it is. So, yeah, this is kind of... Where we came, not quite where we came out of, but maybe it's a different cave. Is over here. But this is that little like um, area that we saw earlier with the bouffalant and stuff. There's one right there. You know, it all kind of leads together. It's not a huge, huge area. It is nice. It's a nice addition. But doesn't this just seem like the kind of place you would find in post game anyway? You know, if like for example, Pokemon Platinum, you go to the post game and you find some stuff. And you're like, oh wow, look, the Battle Frontier and a little bit of extra grass and stuff. That's nice. This is what this feels like. It feels like this is just a bit you see at the end of the game, and instead they're like, you have to. This is gonna cost you 15 points. Jennings a little much, frankly. So this is another cave. I think this cave just leads through to the to the sea. Let's go and see if that's correct. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, so it all kind of leads around to each other. This is a new area, but, you know, what you do is you just go out to the sea and walk around and stuff. And that's it. That's pretty much the whole Isle of Armoire. Let me show you. This is like a little monument thing. This is like a little bay. Whenever you are on your... your bicycle you will come across this area at some point lucky you you know there's not a whole lot of stuff to see on the outsides i really think they put that diglet thing in to get people to try and explore the area if we look at our map now where are we so at the start we were down here we were uh the work i'd see now we're over here Stepping stone sea. We came out of this bay area. So you see if we keep going down this way. We should reach the uh, the area we started at. And that's a pretty good way to kind of bookend this I think. If we wrap it all up. There's a lady again. We're not. You know what? Fuck it. I was going to say we're not going to bet it. We're going to do exactly the same thing. 
a third time. I'm going to do it a third time. That's how confident I am. There's no way it's going to fuck up three times, right? Here we go. Dig. I would suggest, lady, that you buy your a new shovel, right? We're going to go. We're going to go, and then we're going to quit. Here we go. Uh. Let's see. Third time's a charm. Let's do it. For f <laughs> you got to be kidding me, kid. That's three times that happened in the one episode. So this is just stuff you get to look forward to. Whenever you play the Isle of Armoire for yourself. This and more. Oh my goodness. So many different things you could do. So many adventures. So many Kinglers for you to find yourself. So there's a big Waylord. You could find him. You know. I hope you, I hope this is exciting for you. You could find all the Diglets. You know. Why, why, why wouldn't you want to spend the, your life looking for these little tiny hairs that poke out of the ground? I don't see why you would have an issue with that it's amazing what fun what what a great grand old time this would be so if you go into that little dojo right there which i don't think we will do because we're about to wrap things up you you start the story you have to go and find mushrooms and you have to do some other crud I guess we're going to do it. I, I wanted to walk around and have a look, but no, they're going to make me do some story stuff because you can't just explore. Well, I, you know, I say you can't just explore. To be fair, we totally just spent a whole episode exploring. But whatever. Um, I don't want to talk to either of these people. I'm not going to go into the dojo. This is the end of the episode. Practically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm this Everything's coming up roses. According to these people who don't know who I am, I, I spent 40 episodes trying to beat the Elite Four or to, at least to become the champion. I caught a Tertitus, I stopped the bad guy, I caught a Kingler, and yet nobody knows who I am. You know, the sweet, sweet anonymity of being the best Pokemon trainer in the world. It's, 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 it's a hard pill to swallow, but not impossible. I will swallow it. I can swallow anything, dude. I think. If you put it in my mouth, I'll give it a swallow. You know? I'm pretty confident about that. Anyway. Look. I don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> this is the end of today's episode. This is the Isle of Armoire DLC. You know, I haven't spoiled anything. There's loads of stuff to do. Kind of. Not really. But you'll find out if you're interested. The trick, the good stuff is the Crown Tundra, frankly. But we'll get to that in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching this bullshit. And we'll do one of these on the Isle of Armour just for fun. Get out of here, buddy. Oh, I did a twirl too. No, it's going to kick me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'll see you later. <laughs>